Hey everyone, welcome back to Mini Bike Mike's Garage. So we're obviously we're still in the RV. Got Mama Warner with me, and we are in the little town of Crockett, Texas. And we were driving through town, and a little shop caught my eye in particular. Uh, it looked like it had some cars and some bikes, and I saw what I think is an Arthur Fulmer helmet. And as we're driving by, I'm, I'm you know, it's obviously I'm staring at the place and uh, not paying a whole lot of attention. But anyway, we just passed. And we were looking for a spot to pull over, make a sandwich, and eat some lunch. And as we pull into this little parking area here, what happened, Mama? A car pulled up with a young man, jumps out, says, I had to chase you down and see your bikes. <laughs> so, and I believe his name was Shaw, and I will double check uh, here in just a second. So, we're, uh, we're eating some lunch and uh, had a great conversation with him. I asked him if he wanted to ride the bike. What did he say? He said, oh. Me? No, sir. No, no sir. <laughs> Pretty funny. He, I, he, he saw, they saw the chopper, the uh, old Honda chop chop that I've got on the back of the RV. Uh, so anyway, we're going to finish up and eat a, eat a sandwich, and then we're going to run back up here, and we're going to film at his shop and take a look and see what they've got. section here was just flat and it was just really bad and then the head was twisted from the rest of the frame so I just wound up cutting it off. I split the frame in half into two pieces, hammered it all out best I could and then welded it all back together that and then awesome. like I was telling Sean I was like I knew I wasn't going to make it look nice so I didn't even try. Yeah. So, so instead of the tank that's supposed to be underneath the seat here I, I welded in a piece of round tubing so this is the gas tank inside here. And then it's got it's got suicide brake, suicide shift. I've never seen that. <laughs> Ten dollar Harley muffler we bought at the swamp meet. Totally rigid. The, the front end and all of this, everything's solid. So, and then just got an aftermarket little 12 volt, 125 cc engine on it. But yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what was your name? Ronnie Hogg, Filthy Gringo Speed Shop. Filthy Gringo Speed Shop, and we are in Crockett, Texas. We build custom choppers, hot rods, vintage campers, a little bit of everything. Okay, holy cow, look. This is my 1980. Oh, oh my, look at this, eh? Full twisted frame, rabbit ear oh, pull bags. Love that. Look what he has done here. Oh, that's fantastic. So right now we're waiting on a mini coffin tank. My wife's going to design and coffin okay. tank and I'll weld it up. You're going to build it yourself yeah. then? Yeah, we hand fabricate all our parts in house. That is sweet. So this, oh. is, this is what we do is the old school twisted steel. Yeah. And we've been building custom sissy bars, handlebars, floorboards, crash bars. So what? Right now, I got to look at this. This is, look at this thing. 
Yeah, that's the, the radio flyer chop top. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Built a 29 Ford Tudor chop top, and I figured my son needed one to match. I was gonna say, you yeah. must have a little one. Wow. Yeah. We had this thing finished, and then our oldest boy uh, did a mowing job, ended up with a go kart with no motor, no clutch, no, no chain, so he got all the parts. Yeah. What a cool shop, man. What a cool shop. So we built this bike at Swap Meet. We went up to Dallas, a buddy of ours does a Swap Meet up there. Okay. Swap Meet. Yeah. We put the whole bike together. During the swap meet, we did that about in 2015 because I specialized just in the little Honda Trail 70s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And in 2015, uh, the town we live in has had an old vintage bike show type thing. I don't know, there were probably three or four hundred bikes there. Yeah. And uh, we we took a disassembled Honda Trail 70 and assembled it that day That's during the cool. show, and That's then cool. sold raffle tickets and actually gave it away to one of the people there. Yeah, yeah. yeah so. It makes it fun, right? It does make it fun. Yeah. Wow, this is just just a fabulous shop, man. Thank you. So when we bought this building two and a half years ago, it was dilapidated and about to be torn down. Really? So from that wall back, it all collapsed. It's a 5,000 square foot building. This yeah. is a 2,500 square foot showroom and shop, and then we've got a 2,500 square foot three bedroom up in concept house. Okay. Built out in the back. Awesome. Oh, so do you live here too yeah. then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my commute. Yeah, really cool. Is this an Arthur Fulmer helmet? Do you know? No, it's a newer one. Okay. It's a built well. Okay. That's what caught my eye. That that helmet, as I drove by, that caught my eye. You ever heard of Arthur Fulmer helmets? Yeah. They kind of the same thing, had the sparkly with the, uh, and the, I didn't know built well did it, but Arthur Fulmer was the first one to do the like the chrome around there. Most of them have black, like I saw like like, like that one you have on there has the black around it, but the uh, Fulmers have the chrome. But anyway, well, man, we'll get out of your hair. Yeah, I just had. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Okay, so you got that building too, huh? We own half a city block now. Wow. Yeah, we own half a city block. Wow. What are you gonna do with it? I have no clue. <laughs> no clue. <laughs> You're my kind of guy. Just, I just like saving old stuff. Yeah, there you go. Oh my gosh, you're too big and so <laughs> There you go. That was supposed to just be helping me make factory Yeah. This is where his kid's been playing. Wow. Well, I am so glad that uh, Sean came and ran me down. Yeah. And really got to meet to you away. guys. <laughs> <laughs> Go get him. Go get him. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, I'm gonna come around. I'm gonna take a picture. Get, get. Yeah, I gotta get so if you are, if you got anybody that's watching my videos, if you're in Crockett, Texas, or area, uh, so this is Filthy Gringo Speed Shop. Speed Shop. Right. And is it FilthyGringos.com? Is that what yes. I'm seeing? Is that a website? Yeah. So if you guys, uh, anybody seeing this wants to uh, get a hold of these dudes, I'm sure they'd love to talk to you. So, all right, one last time. Hey, thank you for running me down. Yes, sir. Yeah, nice to meet you too. To meet yeah, you. nice to meet you guys. So, all right, guys, there you go. If you're ever in Crockett, Texas, stop in and see these guys.